Hey, Solar Knee Caps here, and we got Heart Gold freaking 26 walkthrough, even though I really don't tell you anything at all except random jokes and crud. So, mm, sorry. Alright, so we're uh, surfing along, and we're gonna go fight this uh, dude in the gym. I don't really remember his name, but he apparently has a weird waterfall thing, and he just, I don't know, gets pounded by it constantly. Anyway, so yeah, um,. This is Black Belt Lido, and he's got a freaking hit much hand. And this is the guy that I fought, uh, if you recall from my last episodes, where I attempted to try this gym um, a couple episodes ago, and uh, this guy completely swept me. So, um, I'm hoping that I can bring upon him horrible pain and destruction, and since I've leveled up a couple of times. So yeah, uh, where was I? Oh yeah, uh, Sleep Powder, Leech Seed combo, very nice, and I'm just gonna keep pounding him with Surfs, you know, and he Ice Punches me, but freaking Steve Irwin, man, he can take that, man, I mean, come on, you're gonna have to try a little harder than that if you wanna take out Steve. So he's like, that was shocking, and I'm like, uh, I think that's someone else's punchline, dude, maybe like, I don't know, the dude from, well, yeah, never mind, okay. Here's another dude. I don't know why I'm fighting him. I'm just attracted to those random assortment of uh, buttons. And this guy's name like long or long, long. <laughs> so yeah, um, he's got a freaking man key. I don't know what he did, but I'm pretty sure these things have vital spirit, so I can't actually like put it to sleep. But um, I'm able to flinch it because um, my health is at 69, so that allows me to flinch whatever the heck I want. So yeah, he's a primate. And he has a very interesting strategy going for him. So yeah, uh, I'm going to go for the Leech Seed, and it hits. And I don't want to have that minus two, so I'm switching to Steve. And he goes for Switch again. And since I know this is freaking Steve Irwin, I know I can, you know, take a hit. Excuse me. But he goes for another one, and I just go for a headbutt. And yeah, so I'm not going to stay in while I'm minus four, because that's just retarded. And he just goes for another Screech. So yeah, um... Very interesting strategy, yes. I can play your game. So yeah, he has another freaking man key, and um, I actually misclick Leech Seed, because I just kind of, I know I can probably two-hit KO this thing with freaking Headbutt, but since I'm a nubble, uh, I just can't do it. So yeah, I'm just going to freaking Headbutt, get the sexy uh, flinch, and sadly, I level up. But at what cost? But yeah, anyway, uh, Repel finally wears off, which I'm like, dang, that's a really good Repel. So here's this dude, and he's like, words are useless. And you're like, okay. So this guy's Knob, and of course, if any of you remember me talking about Knob and Leaf Green, uh, yeah, he's like a editor or director or some form of a guy up there in the rankings in his little place. I don't know. But basically, yeah, he's like a dude and they put him in every single one of the games. Uh, I think he might be a black belt every time. Uh, so yeah, this is where you find him this time. That's always kind of cool trivia. So yeah, uh, I'm going to go to the best counter to him, a choke. Obviously, he's in aim, a, a B palm or whatever. Not aim B palm, but you know what I mean. And I'm just going to tickle it because, you know, there's nothing like a couple of dudes with no shirts tickling each other. You know, that's always hot. So yeah, uh, I'm going to U-turn out of there. And going to Steve, because I know Steve can, you know, headbutt and do some uber damage and whatnot. And he just keeps leering, but you're not going to make Steve Irwin afraid, man. He's just going to sneak up behind you and stub his thumb up your butt. So yeah, um, he's lost. So at least, you know, he doesn't complain about it like a freaking noob. So yeah, I leave. And, uh, yeah, here I am again. So I'm going to go all super awesome solid snake and totally go past that and... Here's a large winch, which uh, maybe it's like really English. And here we see the world's largest induendo. <laughs> Funny. Okay, so yeah, um, Solid Snake again. And yeah, so now we're going to fight uh, this gym leader dude who I don't remember his name, but we will once he says something. So let's find out. And his name is Chuck. And I'm, oh, oh, snap. 
we are gonna fight Chuck freaking Norris. But not just any Chuck Norris. Chuck Norris with mutton chops. As we all know, mutton chops are the most deadly of all facial hair. So yeah, um, he's sadly kind of a double-teaming noob, but I do have a plan. Because in Hard Gold, they kind of made these guys not completely stupid. So um, with that, Mr. The Headbutt, here's my plan. I'm gonna start going for the surf. Now, why would I keep going for surf? Well, because he would naturally switch into this. So now, finally, he doesn't have any evasiveness, and this one doesn't have any weird gay evasiveness stuff, so it's not as difficult to take out. So, right, he's uh, spamming surfs, and he crits me, but since I'm freaking Steve Irwin, I can just eat up that crit for breakfast and he predicts my switch like a pro. I'm like, oh, Chuck Norris with mutton chops. You win this time. So yeah, I'm gonna send a freaking cotton ball to see what uh, she can do. And I'm gonna sleep powder because it doesn't have vital spirit or anything gay. I'm gonna set up a leech seed. And thankfully with this, I'm gonna be able to take another body slam or whatever the heck he wants to throw at me. And I'm gonna start spamming freaking uh, bullet seed right to his groin, but sadly he has a freaking berry, which gives him, like, unmatched power. So yeah, that just kind of like, uh, I do hit five times, which is cool. And I'm looking at that damage, and I'm like, oh my gosh, I could kill this thing if I can hit five times. And I'm like, okay, that's three, that's four, and yeah, I only get five, so let's see how much he lives by. Yeah, look at that, that's like half a pixel, and then he just freaking hyper potion, <laughs> and he like squirts that little like squirt bottle full of like vinegar or something and that like heals him up so yeah i'm just gonna keep spamming spamming a uh, freaking bullet whatever and just hope for the best and sadly he wakes up and he just goes straight for the hypnosis i'm like well that's homosexual and i'm like uh he's probably gonna go for a focus punch or something gay so i have to do the ultimate sacrifice and sacrifice steve Irwin. <laughs> Oh, gosh. So, yes, Blitzen, it's all up to you now, man. You must make sure that Steve doesn't die in vain. So, come on, use the power of Christmas and all that is glory and defeat this primate. So, with these sacred words, I start spamming Stomp, hoping for crits and whatnot, and I miss. But I'm like, oh, I know you can do this, Blitzen, and I hit. So I'm like, yes, that's it, Blitzen. And he goes for a hyper potion. I'm like, oh, you missed, but that's okay, Blitzen. You still got this. So he goes for another double team. I'm like, come on, Blitzen. I know you can do it. And he hits. I'm like, yes. So he goes for the focus. I know you can do this, Blitzen. I hit. And I'm like, come on. I know you got this, Blitzen. He goes for another focus punch. And I hit. So yes, Blitzen. You are now officially a BA and the greatest Pokemon known to man. Freaking Stanler for Uber. So yeah, I freaking beat Chuck Norris with mutton chops, and I get the storm badge, which is kind of stupid. I was expecting maybe like the fist badge, or the super punch bag, or the Mike Tyson badge, but no, I don't get anything cool like that. I get the storm badge. Hooray, storms. So yeah, uh, just kind of like, I talked to this, well actually this chick comes to me, and she's like, hey... Here's a TM for, I think, beating my husband. I think they're related or something. And she gives me flies. So uh, I'm going to look, see who can learn Focus Punch. I kind of hope Blitzen can, because, you know, then I can get the Hypnosis Focus Punch combo, but that doesn't work. So yeah, that kind of stinks, but I don't care. So yeah, um, I'm going here to get some free health care, and you may be wondering, Hey, uh, Solar Kneecaps, don't you usually edit these out? <laughs> well, yes, you are, sport. Normally, I do edit these out. But this happens to be the time where I make a horrible misplay. And yes, I now have to try to beat him again. I mean, this was this took me forever. I mean, there... Uh, you have no idea how long it took. There is not a single... Hope in the world that I'm ever, ever going to do... Alright. <sighs> You've convinced me. I shall do it again. I will beat Chuck Norris with mutton chops again. Yes, you can bet on it. So this is Solar Kneecaps, signing off.